You can expect a lot of controversy and confusion once again in the NFL this season over another rule change. Players can be penalized 15 yards and potentially fined and ejected for lowering their heads to initiate contact with an opponent. The problem is many players are more confused than ever about what's allowed and what isn't. The Bears are already paying a price because of the new rule with their first round draft pick. Scott Lever reports from Bourbon A. Matt Nagy thinks he knows what the rule says. We talk about that that flat line, right? And if you're if you're as long as your um, your head comes up and you can show your face mask, then you're okay. But the second you put the crown of the helmet down, uh, no matter who you are, offense or defense, they're going to look for that. The problem is on almost every play, players put their heads down in that split second before a collision to brace for impact. It's human nature. It's what they've done for years. Nagy knows that the adjustment won't be easy. This game's been playing a certain way for a long time, and it's going to be hard for some of these guys to naturally not do that. That's what they've done. So uh, we have to understand that there's going to be times where in a crucial game where something's called, and uh, um, you know, you're just hoping you're not on the wrong end of it too often. Bears linebacker Danny Trevathan was suspended for one game last season after a vicious helmet hit on Packers receiver Devontae Adams. That was an easy call for the officials to make. But Trevathan knows there will be a lot more gray area this season. It's going to be tough. You know, the game is constantly changing. You know, I'm, I'm right on your side, but, you know, we got to do what the league wants us to do right now, or that's money out of our pockets. The no leading with the helmet rules, the whole reason why top draft pick Roquan Smith remains unsigned. His agent is insisting that Smith not lose any guaranteed money should he be fined under that rule. Trevathan says linebackers could be impacted the most by the new rule. They just have to find a way to keep their edge physically without crossing a line. I'm sure it'll still be physical, just not probably that physical that you're used to. But over time, once we work it, I'm sure it get back to it. Just right hand, head placement, putting your face mask up. You know, it, it's, it's really hard on linebackers, but, you know, we're, we're not in it for the easy part.